Submarines float on the surface by using ballast tanks full of air. There are valves at the top of the ballast tanks that are open when it's time for the submarine to submerge. So how deep can a military submarine go? Today, we'll present you guys the top 10 deepest diving operational submarines in the world. This list is based on test depth, which is the maximum depth at which a submarine is permitted to operate under normal peacetime circumstances. So without further ado, let's get started. At number 10 is the Triumphant class which is a ballistic missile submarine of the French Navy. In French, the submarine is called the Next Generation Device Launching Nuclear Submarine which provides the ocean-based component of France's nuclear deterrent strike force. The submarine's propulsion system is a nuclear turboelectric system based on a Type 15 pressure water reactor supplying 150 megawatt. Submerged displacement of this class is 14,335 tons and it has a test depth of more than 400 meters. At number 9, we have the Bore class which is a nuclear-powered ballistic missile submarine constructed by Sevmash for the Russian Navy. It is a fourth-generation nuclear missile submarine which is less detectable to sonar than its predecessors. Other advancements include a pump jet propulsion. It is also powered by an OK-650 nuclear reactor and AEU steam turbine. It is the first in Russia to run on the pump jet propulsion system and this class has a test depth of 430 meters. At number 8 is the Yasin class, also known as Gorini class. This class is a nuclear-powered cruise missile submarine, again designed by Malakid and being constructed by Safmash for the Russian Navy. Based on the Akula class and Alpha class designs, the Yasin class is projected to replace Russian Navy's current Soviet-era nuclear attack submarines. It is powered with OK-650 KPM pressurized water reactor turbines of 43,000 shaft horsepower. The Yasin class has a test depth of 450 meters. The seventh deepest diving operational submarine in the world is the Akula class. The Akula class is a nuclear-powered attack submarine first deployed by the Soviet Navy in 1986. The main machinery consists of VM5 pressure water reactor rated at 190 megawatt with a GT30A turbine. Two auxiliary diesels rated at 750 horsepower provides emergency power. The propulsion system drives a seven-bladed fixed-pitch propeller and the submarine is rated for a test depth to 480 meters. At number 6 is the Seawolf class submarine. The Seawolf class is a class of nuclear-powered fast attack submarines in service with the United States Navy. This class was the intended successor to the Los Angeles class and the nuclear-powered Seawolf has a GEPWR S6W reactor system, two turbines rated 50 to 1000 horsepower, a pump jet propulsor, a single shaft and one secondary propulsion submerged motor. The Seawolf class submarine is rated for a test depth of 490 meters. Up next at number 5 is the Type 209 submarine which is a German diesel-electric attack submarine. Despite not being operated by the German Navy, five variants of the class have been successfully exported to 13 countries with 61 submarines being built and commissioned between 1971 and 2008. Propulsion include diesel-electric, four diesels, a single shaft with 6,100 shaft horsepower and the test depth of this submarine is the same as the previous one that is 490 meters. And now at number 4, we have the Vanguard class. The Vanguard class is a class of nuclear-powered ballistic missile submarine in service with the Royal Navy. A new pressurized water reactor, the Rolls-Royce PWR2, was designed for the Vanguard class. The reactor drives two GEC steam turbines linked to a single-shaft pump jet propulsor, giving the submarine a maximum submerged speed of over 25 knots. They are the largest submarines manufactured in the UK, displacing 15,900 tons when submerged. This submarine is rated for a test depth of 500 meters. Up next at number 3 is the Sierra class which is a nuclear-powered attack submarine intended for the Soviet Navy and currently in service with the Russian Navy. The class is unique due to its light and strong titanium pressure hull which enables the submarines of the class to dive to greater depths, reduce the level of radiated noise and increase resistance to torpedo attacks. 
It is powered by a single OK650 pressurized water reactor and the Sierra class has a test depth of about 520 meters. At number 2 is the Type 0398 submarine, also known as the Yuan class according to NATO. It is a class of diesel electric submarine developed for the Chinese People's Liberation Army Navy. It is China's first air independent propulsion powered submarine and presumed to be one of the quietest diesel electric submarine classes in service. According to an early assessment by the U.S. Naval Institute, the Yuan class was primarily designed as an anti-ship cruise missile platform capable of hiding submerged for long periods of time in difficult to access shallow littorals. It has a test depth of 550 meters. And now at number one spot is none other than the Oscar class. The Oscar class is the deepest diving operational submarine in the world today. It is a nuclear-powered cruise missile submarine designed in the Soviet Union for the Soviet Navy. They are currently in service with the Russian Navy with some of the vessels planned to be modernized as Project 949AM to extend their service life and increase combat capabilities. The test depth of the Oscar class is 830 meters. And that's it guys, we're winding up the video for today, but before you leave, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button so you won't miss out on any of our new videos. Thank you for viewing in, we'll see you in our next video, bye bye.